Guessing you jumped out of planes before, right? Man, I've crashed a plane. Have you been mountain climbing? Of course. Running with the bulls. Oh fuck no. <laughs> there, there it is. What is it with you and animals? Man, fuck animals. We are at war with all of them. They're all evolving to replace us on the food chain, you know. The less they know about us, the better. Wait, even puppies? Man, especially goddamn puppies. They've infiltrated our society, you know. They're learning what we are. Shit. Yo, we getting you a puppy. Hey, don't make me the guy that kicks a puppy, Marcus. I don't want to be that guy. be good to go. I'll just add the finishing touches and... There. Looks good. Josh and I are on our way. Oh, bring beer. Hey. Nice view. Yeah, I noticed. Fly like foot. And now to watch that sweet, sweet burn. Sure you configured it properly? 
Dude, I don't question you about crypto shit, do I? Guys, shut up. I'm in. Here with the CEO of Home, who I'm told has a little Always got a surprise for them, all right. I brought our newest device with me, and I'm happy to announce the launch of Home 2.0. Hell yeah! Just a simple yes. push of a button. <laughs> That's what? the dead sec logo. Oh, I'm sorry. Would you oh care to comment God. on that? Oh my God! Nice. Turn it off. We're done. We're done here. We're done. Citizens of the digital age. Welcome, come, come. Home thought they could fool you. Ooh. They sold you a system to monitor your homes, promising privacy, security, and convenience. Home is selling your habits. habits. In fact, you pay a monthly subscription fee for the privilege of being sold to the highest bidder. It's time to wake up. Reclaim the value inherent to who you are. If you don't control that information, someone else will. You can pray our corporations treat you favorably, or you can take matters into your own hands. DedSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. That was humiliating! Steven, Steven! You took a bad beat, buddy. It happens. Listen to me, you smart son of a bitch! You promise! Not your smartest move, Steven. You've had some monumental fuck-ups recently. Sit down. Uh, dude, I gave you the means to, you know, be proactive with all that data. And you screwed the pooch on fucking television, dude. Somebody's probably doing an auto-tune of your interview right now. Don't go near dead sec. They're my responsibility. All you need to do is figure out an apology to my lawyers for laying your hands on me. You gonna be okay? You gonna be okay? Say yes. There you go. I'm gonna get you a glass of water. to get back here right now. What's going on? Nothing good. Hurry. Marcus, what does home system look like to you? CTOS Junior. So it wouldn't surprise you to know that they've got a deal going on with Bloom. After what we just did to them? Yes. I bet all deals are off now. What were the terms? CTOS code is the base of home software. Collected data sold back to Bloom. At a hefty discount, of course. Sounds like we showed up at the right time, then. Chicago DedSec has coordinated operations. Shit, shit, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Hey, man, shit, what's, shit. hey, what's going on? I was looking at our numbers, how many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we had available, and that's when I saw it. It, what, it, what? A chunk of our followers and bots came from inactive or dead invite accounts. Hey, wait, so someone used a social media site to boost our numbers? Who? And how many fucking accounts, I don't man? know who, but it came from inside invite. Someone with admin access, I'm sure of that. As for how many... Fuck Sorry. Me. Sorry, I didn't check. It's 
No, it's all my fault. I didn't check. Josh, no, I didn't check. You no, know, maybe someone inside invite is a fan. Yeah, or maybe we're getting set up to get fucked. Checked. We need to find out. Marcus, find your way inside. I should have just Josh, checked. Josh, it's not your fault, okay? Look, we all saw the numbers. You're the only one who caught it. You did good. You did good. Huh? How's DedSec taking the new dawn victory? Eating it up. Protests are going full force across the country, and people who aren't even associated are standing next to us. Couldn't have gone better. Well, not unless the church shut down completely. <laughs> we'll keep pushing until it does. With Miranda and Jimmy Siska on the front lines, New Dawn's taking a huge hit. It's looking like Cyber Driver might wind up the surprise hit of the year. <laughs> well, we won't hold our breath for a thank you card from HMP. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Apparently, our home CEO tested his new software on his own family. You're joking. His wife filed for divorce this morning, citing illegal surveillance of a minor. Whoa, so he's looking at jail time? It's all conjecture right now, but it seems possible. Turns out, secretly spying on people tends to make them a little angry. Mm, who would have guessed? This fake follower shit has me spooked. And you're waiting for the other shoe to drop. I know. I'm feeling it, too. It's not just that. Okay, so yeah, what if someone else is playing us? What's bothering me is losing face. That'll cost us even more. How can we talk about pulling back the curtain when we're all tangled up in it? We can't talk about changing the system when we're still getting gamed by it. Marcus Holloway, scourge of the church. Come on! Marcus Holloway, bane of tablet fakery. Awful! Marcus Holloway, duskbringer of the new dawn. Ooh, I like that one. Let's go with that one. print something on the 3D printer, but the others don't think it's gonna work. Uh, what is it? A dildo or a cat? I uh, haven't made up my mind yet. <laughs> Between a dildo or a cat? People keep talking about printing guns, except they all make them look like guns. Why can't it be a dildo or a cat or a unicorn? And then, BAM! Its true purpose is revealed. Uh, sounds like you need to spend some time prototyping your unicorn dildo gun. You know, before worrying about the aesthetics. That resin is not cheap, man. It's a fair point. Hey, you know how many times the average person shits a day? This is a long-winded joke that ends with home data dump, isn't it? Listen to some of these categories. Pre-30s heart attack, undiagnosed diabetic, two weeks pregnant? I'm never buying an internet accessible camera ever again. Good luck with that. I hope you don't like cell phones. Or TVs. Or sex toys. And not my sex toys, too. Why do they have to ruin everything? Half the time, I can't tell if shit is Darwin Award-level stupidity or some asshole's idea of a marketing stunt. What are we talking about? This shit with invite. I don't like feeling used, Marcus. It makes me want to take a sledgehammer to limbs and jumper cables to soft body parts. <laughs> we'll deal, man. Whatever comes next, we'll deal. Yeah, but my coping mechanisms involve breaking things. So just promise me that when the time comes, you'll let me blow shit up. <laughs> you got it. I've been digging a bit deeper into the studio's data sharing deal with Bloom, and the thing is, the studio let them have some of the user data, but Bloom's accessing more of it without the studio's knowledge. 
And the studio hasn't noticed? No, because the studio is using CTOS infrastructure. It's getting grabbed there. Josh must be right. Bloom's using it to improve their facial recognition with emotion mapping. Combine that with profiler data? What have they got? Some scary predictive algo in the works. That's the way I see it, too. What's up? We're getting a lot of buzz. Hackers wanting to sign up with us, other groups wanting to rally banners. Well, that's some Game of Thrones shit, man. That's what got me worried, too. Won't take long before some troll tries to join up and hurt us from the inside. That's why we're taking so long, vetting new blood. Yeah, it pays to be safe. Marcus, I was just reading comments from DedSec members. Our New York members set fire to a new Dawn Center. Are we okay with that? That's what happens when you have a group with no rules or leaders. You can work towards a basic message, but you can't control every reaction. Our message on this one is right. You just have to be good with that. Yeah, okay. I'm good with that. Are you good with that? Yeah. Galilee was on the right track in their car dev. Looks like their plan was to feed the driver data into a machine learning algo. Meanwhile, Noodle's still using rule sets. Guess we shouldn't be surprised when Galilei releases a car into the wild that really works. Only a matter of time, man. Home's databases are filled with all kinds of useful information. I've already identified a list of people who would be likely to join DedSec if offered the opportunity. Can't do it. That's crossing the line. If we're trying to show how DedSec is siding with privacy, we can't get caught using that data for ourselves. We do use stolen data, though. Even the profiler. I hear you, and we do use some... Necessary evils, but those aren't under a PR microscope. Whether or not it's moral is a whole other conversation. The data already exists. Not using it would be immoral. Drop the tables, Josh. We're getting close now. This is gonna be huge. How does it feel, man? Amphora. It's an ancient Greek bottle. Just good? No, like, um, really good. So good. Feels so good. Okay, this just got a little creepy. Sorry. <laughs> 